Naruto, 10 Forbidden Jutsu that characters use all the time. Forbidden Jutsu, also known as Kinjutsu, are shinobi techniques that are banned from use in the Naruto universe, but still get used anyways. Naruto is one of the most popular anime in history. Reasons for this can be attributed to its likable characters, dangerous villains, and maintaining a level of consistency over its 720 episodes Shippuden included. A major aspect of Naruto is the vast array of abilities ninjas can perform. These abilities are known as Jutsu and they're incredibly diverse. Some of them include destructive balls of chakra, manipulating the elements, and summoning giant animals. The capabilities of Jutsu are almost unlimited, but not all are recommended. Forbidden Jutsu, also known as Kinjutsu, are shinobi techniques that are banned from use due to either violating the laws of nature, causing harm to the user, or simply because they're too destructive. Despite this, a number of several forbidden techniques are used throughout. 10. Wind Release Raisin Shuriken. Invented by Naruto Uzumaki, Raisin Shuriken combines Naruto's chakra with wind nature to create a deadly and destructive technique that few can survive. This jutsu became a mainstay in Naruto's arsenal and is one of the most used in the series. However, before perfecting the technique, the lovable protagonist would severely damage his arm after performing the jutsu. Additionally, Raisin Shuriken damaged Naruto's own chakra network. It wasn't until the prodigy mastered Sage Mode that the Jutsu was performed safely. 9. Edo Tensei Arguably the coolest technique in Naruto, Edo Tensei, also known as Impure World Reincarnation, allows the user to bring people back from the dead. Created by Tobarama, Senju and improved upon by Orochimaru and later Kabuto. The Jutsu is used throughout the anime and plays a major part in the fourth Shinobi World War. Fans are first exposed to it during Orochimaru's attempted destruction of the Hidden Leaf. Furthermore, one of the most iconic scenes in Naruto involves the application of Edo Tensei to resurrect the four Hokage. 8. Izanagi One of the many terrifying abilities belonging to the famed Sharingan, Izanagi is a genjutsu that allows the user to alter destiny. Extremely overpowered, Izanagi is forbidden due to the fact it breaks the laws of nature. But this doesn't stop those capable from using it. During his battle with Sasuke, Danzo uses the ability numerous times to rewrite his fate. Additionally, Abito and Madara have used the technique. The latter to come back from the dead. If used too often, Izanagi can cause the user to lose sight in his eye. 7. Multi-Shadow Clone Jutsu Not to be confused with the standard shadow clone jutsu used by most shinobi, multi-shadow clone jutsu requires the user to produce more than just a single clone. Creating a single clone significantly reduces one's chakra and therefore producing any more was considered dangerous to the user. Because of this, the jutsu was classified as forbidden. But there are some shinobi who can use it safely. This was Naruto's most popular jutsu, and due to being an Uzumaki and a Jinchuriki, he could safely produce multiple clones. 6. Cursed Seals of Heaven and Earth A forbidden jutsu created by Orochimaru Surprise, Surprise, the user experiences an increase in abilities and chakra levels. Appealing to those who desire more power. Cursed Seals of Heaven and Earth can erode the mind of the user, allowing Orochimaru to take over their body. Due to being an Uchiha and prodigy, Sasuke was branded with the Cursed Seal of Heaven. However, Sasuke wasn't the only user. Orochimaru blessed most of his disciples with the cursed mark, putting the number of users in double figures. 5. Strength of a Hundred Seal An ancient jutsu developed during the Sage of the Six Path Era, 
this forbidden technique requires the user to store chakra over a prolonged period of time. Once stored, the user can release the stored chakra at any time, greatly strengthening their techniques. This jutsu is used by both Tsunade and Sakura, legendary medical ninjas with precise chakra control. Often, the jutsu is used in tandem with the summon katsuyu, making the summon a formidable opponent. Despite its tremendous power, Tsunade also used it for more trivial things, including maintaining a youthful appearance. 4. Reaper Death Seal A forbidden jutsu developed by the Uzumaki clan, Reaper Death Seal is so secretive that even Orochimaru knew nothing about it. Fans first witness the incredible spectacle when Hiruzen Sarutobi attempts to seal away Orochimaru, but can only seal his arms. Additionally, Reaper Death Seal is used by Minato Namikaze to seal away Kurama, a testament to its incredible strength. Finally, Orochimaru uses the technique to release previously consumed souls. While not used all the time, the rarely used ancient technique was performed three times in a matter of years. 3. Creation Rebirth Considering Tsunade was Hokage, one could assume she would refrain from using forbidden jutsu. But there's no point worrying about setting an example when your life's on the line. Creation Rebirth is a jutsu resulting in near invulnerability, instantly healing any wound in a matter of seconds. By storing and releasing chakra, the user forces the body to recreate cells in seconds. Labeled as the pinnacle of medical ninjutsu, Tsunade and Sakura are the only known shinobi to master the technique. 2. Iwagakure Kinjutsu a jutsu passed down through generations in Iwabikure, the user can feed chakra into materials and use this to manipulate objects. The user can increase the size of an object, shape it, and even animate it. Akatsuki member Deidara frequently used Iwabikure Kenjutsu in combination with his explosive Kekiai Genkai. The shinobi created birds and dragons from clay using this technique and detonated the objects once his opponent was in range. These abilities made Deidara a difficult opponent. 1. Eight Gates Although not technically listed as a forbidden jutsu, the eight gates have been likened to one due to the impact it has on the user. First introduced by Rock Lee during the Chunin exams and later mastered by Mike Guy. The eight gates allow shinobi to use all of their chakra. Traditionally, the user cannot use more than 20% of their body's full capability. However, opening any of the gates grants the user access to more of their chakra. When all eight gates are open, the individual can bend space with the speed of their movements. <laughs> 